Thank you for joining our Advent Meditation Compline for Saturday, December 17th, 2022. Compline is the office that completes the day. It has been called the bedtime prayer of the church. In this meditative compline, let us relax into a comfortable position. Be still, aware of God's presence within and around you. Our call to prayer, O oh God, come to our assistance, O oh Lord, hasten to help us. The Holy One grant us a restful night and peace at the last. Amen. Our Advent hymn is Silent Night, Holy Night. Silent Night. Holy night, all is calm, all is bright, brown yon virgin, mother and child, holy infant so tender and mild, sleep in heavenly peace. Sleep in heavenly peace. Silent night, holy night. Shepherds quake at the sight. Glory stream from heaven afar. Heavenly hosts sing alleluia. Christ the Savior is born, born. Christ the Savior is born. Our confession and assurance. O most holy and beloved, our companion, our guide upon the way, our bright evening star, we repent the wrongs we have done. We have wounded your love. O oh God, heal us. We stumble in the darkness. Light of the world, transfigure us. We forget that we are your home. Spirit of God, dwell in us. Eternal Spirit, living God, in whom we live and move and have our being, all that we are, have been, and shall be is known to you, to the very secrets of our hearts, and all that rises to trouble us. Living flame, burn into us. Cleansing wind, blow through us. Fountain of water, well up within us, that we may love and praise in deed and in truth. We are a forgiven people. Thanks be to God. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Psalm 139, verses 11 and 12. If I say, surely the darkness will cover me, and the light around me turn to night. Darkness is not dark to you, the night is as bright as the day. Darkness and light to you are both alike. 
Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. Our scripture reading comes from 2 Corinthians chapter 4, verses 6 and 7. The God who said, let light shine out of darkness, is the God who shines in our hearts with light, bringing us the radiance of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Jesus Christ. We have this treasure in common, earthenware, so that the incomparable power is clearly from God and not from us. Holy wisdom, holy word. Thanks be to God. Be present, Spirit of God, within us, your dwelling place and home, that here all darkness may be penetrated by your light, all troubles calmed by your peace, all evil redeemed by your love, all pain transformed in your suffering, and all dying glorified in your risen life. Amen. Join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Our night hymn, God who made the earth and the heaven. God who made the earth and heaven, darkness and light. Who the day for toil has given, for rest the night. May thy angel guards defend us, slumber sweet thy mercy send us. Holy dreams and hopes attend us this live long night. When the constant sun returning on seals our eyes may we born anew like morning to labor rise gird us for the test that calls us let not ease and self enthrall us strong through thee whatever befall us O oh, god most wise In peace, we will lie down and sleep. In the Lord alone, we safely rest. Guide us waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. May the divine help remain with us always, and with those who are absent from us. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit, for you have redeemed me, O Lord, O God of truth. Canticle of Simeon Lord, you have set your servant free to go in peace as you have promised. For these eyes of mine have seen the Savior whom you have prepared for all the world to see. A light to enlighten the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Glory to you, O Trinity, most holy and blessed, one God, now and forever. Amen. 
brothers and sisters in Christ, this Advent season and beyond, may the Holy and Blessed Trinity guard and bless us. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God.